At the administration's briefing this morning on the coronavirus, we will, were told by the experts, NIH, CDC, that there is a very strong chance of an extremely serious outbreak of the coronavirus here in the United States. So I want to talk about the preparations of this administration and what you've been doing. You've had more than a month now to prepare for this increasing likelihood. And I want to ask you, is our country ready? So our country is preparing every day and the effective, aggressive containment measures that we've taken at our borders, as well as working with our public I, health I departments, mean, have, have bought us time to continue preparedness. One is always advancing preparedness. Every day one advances those activities. Okay, and Mr. The, Secretary, the emergency let, sub would help I only that. have a few minutes. Um, did you stockpile any of these critical supplies that we are told we need, masks, protective suits, ventilators, anything? Is that stockpiled and ready? So we do have in the Strategic National Stockpile ventilators. We have masks. We have Enough? Other prepared, well, of course not, or we wouldn't be asking for a supplemental to seek more money to procure more of that for this for this circumstance. This is a very, this is an unprecedented potential severe health challenge globally um, and will require these additional measures. Okay. It seems to me as I, at the outset that uh, this request uh, for the money, the supplemental, is lowballing it, possibly, and you can't afford to do that. I hope the administration, we want to help the administration. We want to help you do your job. But if you lowball something like this, uh, you'll pay for it later. So the, the steps that the president has taken are the most aggressive containment measures ever uh, in history in terms of travel restrictions at our borders, funneling passengers, restricting foreigners from coming into our country if they've been in China, travel restrictions and advisories to countries. Um, we cannot hermetically seal off the United States to a no, virus, no. and we need to be realistic about that. And so this virus, we Life will have more cases. Life goes on in some form. It, it, it does, and we'll have more cases in the United States. And we've been very transparent about that. And we will then work to mitigate the impact of those.